Hey Aries, how's it going? How are you guys doing? I hope you guys are doing fantastic. If this is your first time checking out Julia Divine's channel, what is that? My name is Amy. If you are returning, welcome back to my channel. So this is your weekend message for the weekend of October 25th of 27. So let's get started, Aries. So right off the hop, what I feel like you're going to be going through this energy of feeling like you're doing everything by yourself this weekend, feeling like you literally have no help, whether this is at home, whether this is at work, whether this is in a relationship or a friendship, whatever it is, but it's literally like you carrying all the burdens, like everything is on your shoulders. Everyone's coming after you. Everyone wants something for you. And you're in this place of like, I literally have nothing left to give. I literally feel like the world is on my shoulders. Like I don't even know how to get myself out of this. That's the type of energy I'm picking up with a ton of wands. So just know that you have to be able to set some healthy boundaries this weekend. You have to be able to tell people, look, you need to do this on your own. I'm already carrying on enough. Like it's being able to say no this weekend, like the big capital N O Aries. That's what I'm hearing. All right. So a lot of you have been looking ahead. A lot of you haven't really been paying too much um time nor energy onto the past, however that resonates with you, but it's kind of like you got to this place where you're like, you know what, I've been single for a while and I've been doing the work and I've been taking care of myself and I've been waiting for love to happen. Well, guess what? Love and love is on the horizon. So that's what I heard. So it's being in this place where it's like, you know what, I have to continue going that way instead of looking backwards. So be in this place this weekend where just keep focused on what you guys have been doing and not really paying attention to everyone else's relationship just because everyone else seems happy around you this weekend does not necessarily mean that that's what, what's going on behind closed doors. Because we often get into that mindset that, oh, I wish I had a relationship like Jack and Jill, but you don't know what's going behind closed doors when it comes to Jack and Jill, right? So it's just being cautious that don't go back into that negative mindset that you're unworthy or unlovable this weekend because love is definitely coming towards you guys with a page of wands. And I do feel like someone wants to come towards you with an offer because we have the king of wands and the king of cups. So you guys could be dealing with a fire sign or a water sign, um, Aries. But I feel like the only reason this person hasn't come towards you and told you how they feel is Again, they probably see you already taking on a lot and they don't know how to add to your life right now. So they're waiting on the sidelines. They're waiting for the perfect moment to come towards you. So I think the best thing you could do for yourself is really know that you have a lot of passion. Really know that passion is coming towards you. Taking that control, taking that power this weekend, not shutting the doors to those new opportunities that want to come through because we have the Ace of Wands coming. So this is all about power and control this weekend. Just you know, taking care of you, realizing that you, you are important and you are attracting the right type of people towards you. But again, like eight, eight of wands is here. So this tells me that you guys are going to be following love. You guys can meet someone while traveling. You could even meet someone out and about, but there's definitely something like a fast communication coming through. So maybe you meet someone and it's just like instant. Everything just seems to fall right into place. If that's not the case, then with the eight of wands, it's that once you close that door or once you close that mindset that love's not going to happen for you, because I do sense that some of you are doing that. You're blocking new love from coming, coming through because you're afraid of past hurt or past pain repeating itself. Once you let go of that barrier, once you let go of that mindset, love, love will steady come through towards you. But you know, that's where you have to go with the queen of wands. And, that, and that's, talks about really self-love that talks about taking care of yourself, knowing your worth, knowing your value, knowing that, you know, you should never allow someone to make you feel like you're unworthy. And like when someone does that, that means that you've given them the power to. So it's like taking your power back this week and taking your control back. Like I said, you know, you know what you want. And if you don't, that means you need to be working on yourself before you try to get yourself involved with someone else. Aries. Okay, because you guys are above water. Even though it doesn't feel it right now, you're not drowning in your emotions. You're not drowning in life. You just need to set some healthy boundaries this weekend. You need to be able to trust yourself to do things alone. You are protected. You're being divinely guided. There's a lot of blessings um, around you right now, but there's also a lot of lessons. So you are going through some lessons right now. So even though things may not make sense, they will eventually. So have gratitude. Um fulfillment is on this way connections are on this way abundance is on its way but i feel like at this time if you're not sure what you want in life it's it's manifesting that it's asking the universe you know 
this is what I want, this is what I want, and this is what I want. So the universe can create it for you and bring it back to you. And the star is here. So you guys are on a new path, but you got to have faith, you got to have hope, and you got to know that you are worthy of this new beginning. All right? So that is what I have for you guys for the weekend of the 25th to 27th, Aries. You guys take care, and I'll see you guys again soon.